Tom's free kick to Essendon this time around, and it will be Big Bell Chambers. And he puts it out in front of Monfrey's southern side for Essendon. Has Lloyd coming a long way from home. Lost his footing, but uh, Maguan overshot the mark. Oh, that was clever, Lloyd. He was on his preferred side, but soccer is not his preferred game. And now Jet against Azaharakis. And Essendon have their first serious scoring chance. And this bloke made a hero of himself on Anzac Day, uh, From didn't about he? this spot, but not from the set position. But he's done the same job here. It's the Bombers first. Love it and bounce the footy. And tonight's a perfect night to do that. Ryder reaching over Patterson. Polo, who started well, nowhere to go here. Watson applying the tackle and winning a free kick. Yeah, it had to be paid, Tim. Uh, incorrect disposal, and he had, I'd say, four. Are you on him, Das? Are you on him? Yeah, I'll back him in. So a four out of ten chance, and he makes no mistake. Absolute precision appointed it now. And now Coglin on his wrong side, tried to compose himself, but just couldn't get the mechanics right. I reckon they've been instructed tonight. You go through the corridor at every stage you come off the ground because he had an option down the line and he just looked in board at every occasion. Poor old uh, Elwyn Davey got set up by Dempsey on that occasion. But the Bombers are still buzzing around. Ryder uses Dempsey. That's a better bit of delivery. Couldn't miss that Matthew Lloyd if he tried. Well done from Courtney Dempsey, who's a very exciting player. Let's watch the kick. It's pretty big, isn't it, as far as the game goes, because the Tigers lead by 10, but now it's back to four. Well done, Lloyd. Stanton only four disposals to this stage of the game. Bombers uh, working hard here to make the most of a concerted attack. And Zaharakis with the chance to finish, receiving from Watson's left boot. Well done, Joe Watson. Just pulled the kick and made Zaharakis lead into it. For his second goal, and he makes no mistake. The Bombers pull one back. Hard grunt football. He's got the skills, he's got the run, he's got the talents. He's got to do it in close as well, and that was great. He's had an up and down season so far, but no doubt with the return of Cochin and Coglin, and when Cousins comes back, their midfield, when it's up and running, he's not too bad, the Tigers. Gee, this is pretty easy, though, isn't it, for the Bombers? Hocking goes inside and puts it straight through. There's an answer. Yeah, well, the hands are in kick. the back. It, it was a free kick on the video at the start of the year. I've got a question for you, Rob, but I'll just wait till play stops. It's stopped now. Free Alvin Davy hurting his head, getting a free. Tell me a Richmond Premiership player no, in your war number four. Nahas is doing it equally as well. Davy squeezes it home. Margin 16. Pain on his face, straight back down the race, so uh, one short at the moment, the Bombers. Hocking, love it, Murray, and now Watson. He's got Monfries away, if he could just get it through, he goes via Dyson. And now Monfries into the space, and Lloyd will fill that comfortably. Joe Watson, sensational with his hands. Got the footy, lifted his arm. So the Tigers dominating the clearances out of the middle particularly, getting their hands on the footy and controlling the game. But the Bombers have kicked important goals, and there's another one. So the margin is back to nine, and it's certainly game on. He's got to move this on quickly. Uh, sorry, Tim, Matty, Matty White, because that's what they've done all night, and he just paused and hesitated. That's a, not great option. Simmons is there with half the ball. That is a screamer. Love it, Murray, just floating in. Position and go back to the brilliant mark from uh, Love at Murray. Sensational stuff, but Simmons automatically. Again, the Bombers refuse to be denied. They want to keep running and yelling and handballing, and we know why. This is Hocking, and it is an open forward line. And the free kick has been paid to Monfries. Lloyd's back in the square. Happy to be a free kick. He wants it quickly because he wanted to get it one on one to Lloyd. You can see McGon trying to hem Lloyd against the goal line. Still a bit of space for him. Monfries, though, has other ideas. Pushing wide, very wide, trying to... He had Nagel in mind. Did he apply a tackle illegally? No play on. Dyson will do the honours and delivers beautifully for Winderlich of uh, why the Bombers have gone better than most people expected so far this season. This is a big kick for him. Hasn't scored tonight. Oh. And he passes off to Watson. Surprised everyone. Well, the Bombers need it. 
Again, they've been able to get crucial goals through the night. And Watson shows his maturity, threads it, and it's back to 12. And it's given Essendon with a goal to Watson, a bit of a sniff. There's a good spoil from Dempsey. Dyson roving it. Stanton receiving. Davy loose. Bombers building up to something here. Watson been pretty good with his feet tonight. Lloyd, the veteran goal kicker, can't go for it. Neither does Jetta, but Monfries can. Did it well, the Bombers. Next week, they've got Geelong, and uh, the week after that, Adelaide. This to bring Essendon closer than they've been for quite a while. And Monfries delivers for them. It's back to seven points. Yet to kick a goal in this third quarter. We are 14 minutes in. Just going to loop it up and hope that a Tiger... Oh! Oh! He's been the king of the air tonight. <laughs> what a mark. Leaping for joy, kicking opportunities away in this quarter. But here is Nathan Lovett-Murray, the high watermark of the night. What about the hang time? There's no doubt about the skills and the thrills. Here's Delidio. He likes the Bombers too. The kick falling short. Well, they've got Big Simmons down there. Oh. And he's just got to present. He's got to present and give a contest with the long kicks coming in. Love it's on the end of this and Watson's further afield. But he'll want to cut through the middle of the MCG. Has Essendon love to do. Love it, Winderlich, two of the most dangerous. And Davy to fly. And Davy to hang on for dear life. And then Winderlich, the options open up. It's a great brand of football. Now, the conclusion to all that, Elwyn Davey is up to the moment, and it's back to seven points. Playing on uh, through the ground, it seems as though they've tightened up a bit this stage of the game. Bombers, of course, have been fast finishers in tight situations this year. Right now, they are really threatening. They're circling, in fact. He was the one who swept it forward. A few of his mates finished it off, but uh, Watson has been the player who sets up so many of the... Here he is again. Here he is again. Just sets him up time and time again. I think he hand-passed at that time too, unlike the previous one. It's in dangerous. They'll get a free kick. Matthew Lloyd will surely put them in front for the first time all night. The Bombers were on level terms halfway through the first quarter. They've trailed since then up until a moment ago as they drew level. And Matthew Lloyd puts them a goal in front with his third of the night. And uh, it's been halted in this third quarter. And I guess when you think about it, that was the, the one area where if Essendon could get back on level terms or start to win, then it would be a transformation in the game. Essendon really going through a phase here of attacking and winning all the contests they need to win. The little man are loving it as well. Monfries to Lloyd. The Bombers are lining up the MCG. More high fives for Matthew Lloyd and his cohorts in the red and black. When you go into that self mode and look after yourself, you get beaten. Marks inside 50 tonight. 20 to Richmond, 16 to Essendon. Oh! There's been some serious leaps tonight. Ryder right up there with him, and he did it again last week. What a spectacular player he is, and this bomber team. I this think new he kissed him. This, he, like he did, it was worth a it kiss a, and a cuddle. A question you've got to ask, why would Newman kick it long to the Essendon Ruckman when Simmons in picture is uh, 15 metres inside that area? They are a spectacular team. Both running and leaping and kicking goals from everywhere. Little, little smooch. Well, the Tigers now the best part of three goals down and all the fire, all the fury seems to have burnt out. He goes white. Pulled off the kick. No good. Watson, Ryder. Tambling's got him. Stanton. Dispossessed by Jackson, but uh, the Bombers hold up. Pairs to Davey. Spoil coming from Newman, but Winderlich on the burst. Low, flat, straight. The Bombers are romping away. 
And now they trail by four goals. Six in 15 minutes from the Bombers. Kelvin Moore, the defender, will try and stop the rot. Watson dropping the mark. That could be costly, but no. Essendon have all the answers. Hooley to Dempsey. Dyson. And he has a lovely choice here in Lovett, who will try and play on. Polo fell on his back and gives away a free kick. Now advantage called as Lovett breaks. And oh, it's fruit for the sideboard. They're rubbing it in. You say, have you heard of character? This builds it. Absolutely. <laughs> More through the corridor, which uh, Richmond did so effectively early in the night. No effect here. Hooker, been pretty good. Kick a bit of a skimmer. Monfrey's eye is all this. With Richmond in disarray, yeah. Davey can be the latest. That is so disappointing because the effort in the first half was very, very good. It's out to 31. Alwyn Davey makes it 37 with Essendon's eighth goal in 20 minutes. Has produced a crowd of 73,625. This occasion has certainly arrived on the AFL calendar. 58,000 the first time, 62 the second, 60 the third, and tonight, we should say, in magnificent conditions, 73,000. It's a great side at the G. And Zaharakis, we have already got the plaudits. Das, I think, in, in this young man. They certainly his, have. Just his first year of AFL footy. Clean user of the ball. Nice skills on display again. 32 points between the sides. Football public. And there'd be people here from country areas, there'd be people from interstate as well as people from Melbourne. But 73,000 people for a team which is eighth on the ladder playing 15th. It's wonderful. Hocking to Winderlich from 49. There's another one. Nathan Brown, Simmons, Ben Cousins, Joel Bowden. Of that half dozen, are any of them kept next year? Let's wait to celebrate the moment for the Bombers, who win by 40 points. Came from oblivion, really, to win this game. And they've won the dream time at the G.